opportunity is this for you to open up the season at home against, against the rival? Yeah, uh, you know, it's a, it's a great opportunity for both teams. Um, you know, I think both teams traditionally, if you look at the, over the last 30 years, the baseball teams and the soccer teams probably have been the highest ranked sports over the history of the rivalry. And so, you know, Clemson comes in very highly ranked, great team, great year last year. You know, we come in ranked in all three polls, so it'll be a big game. Um, you know, it's early. And so from that standpoint, it's a little, uh, the teams are not the same teams that they're going to be at the end of the season, but we need to be at our best uh, that night. So it'll be, a, you know, a big, big, big game. Doesn't matter if you played it on Christmas Eve or if you played it on the, you know, back in April. It's a big game every year. Yeah, you know, talk about it here at the beginning of the season, but the fact that it is two ranked teams, you know, everyone nationally is probably going to be paying attention. You know, what kind of springboard could that be to start off the year for you? Yeah, it's big because uh, it's an important game, you know, in terms of your RPI and it's an important game in terms of the NCAA tournament maybe at the end of the year. So, you know, it's going to be big. I think both teams, you know, don't stand to lose anything in this match. Um, I think nationally it's going to be one of the marquee matchups and, you know, both teams will, number one, have a, an opportunity to line up and see where they are, number one. Number two, you're going to have a good opportunity to know exactly where you are going forward uh, against this. And, and when you play teams that are really top teams, you really tend to gain in the long run. And uh, so, you know, Clemson's a great team. You know, it'll be a great game. You know, looking at Russell, you bring back a lot of upperclassmen that have already played a lot. You also have a lot of sophomores that played a lot last year, got that experience, and then a really talented class of freshmen. Do you, you like how your roster kind of shapes up for this year? Yeah, I think two things. Um, each of the last three years, we've lost uh, a player to major injury before we even kicked the ball in the fall, uh, in the summer. So that's been really tough. Uh, this year, we've, you know, knock on wood, we've escaped that. We're relatively healthy, and we have a nice group of guys back that have a good bit of experience having, you know, gone. Uh, Second round of the NCAA tournament last year, uh, conference championship game two years ago, and the semifinals last year. So I think we have a group that has a little bit of experience, and so that's good. I like our newcomers. I think we have a very good group of young players that have come in and, you know, will make an impact in this team. So um, I'm really pleased with where we are at this moment. You know, with Clemson, obviously we know what they were able to do last year. Uh, what, what do you have to do to kind of? have success against them tomorrow? Yeah, I think the first thing is, you know, we, you know, this game has a lot of emotion. So you have to be able to, to withstand that emotion. You have to be able to ride that emotion uh, and kind of then let the game settle down and see. Uh, I think for us, keys are, be, you know, to be defensively sound, to be able to, you know, take advantage of mistakes that they make. And, and in a big game like this, um, that's often the case. You know, both teams kind of play each other to a standstill sometimes, and then some, somebody makes a play. And uh, that's going to be the important thing, you know, in this game, I think, as well. What kind of home field advantage could you have? I know you're trying to break the attendance record here. It's how important can that be? Can it give you that extra edge? Yeah, the home field advantage is enormous. Um, this is a great place to play. Um, it's a loud place to play. And it's a very uh, action paced, you know, uh, enthusiastic place to play for our fans. So, um, you know, I think tomorrow night we want to ask everybody to come out and, and be a part of history. Uh, I don't think there's any question. We've got a you know great shot at breaking the record, no question. So, you know, what a great thing to be a part of that historically. Um, you know, we've had this program for 38 years, I think, and uh, to have the all-time record and to be a part of it would be pretty cool for our fans. Um, and it'll be great for our team. So uh, we're looking forward to that advantage tomorrow night. Uh, one of the newcomers, Luca, has been playing really, really well. Um, how do you think he'll give you a leg up against Clemson? Well, you know, he's a really good player. Um, he's still, you know, a, a freshman. So this will be his first uh, big home game against a big rival. So, you know, that, that's always a challenge. But I think he's, he's, he's got good experience. He's a very talented kid. And I think he's going to show a lot during the course of this year and the course of his career. Um, you know, Julian uh, Vinuldal, you know, is also a guy that's done very well as a freshman for us in the early part of preseason. So we've got some good young guys out there that I think can make a big impact. And, uh, you know, hopefully they'll be able to help give us a lift. How 
How do you expect the younger guys or the new guys to react to such a big game as tomorrow's? Yeah, that remains to be seen. I mean, uh, you know, I, I can't tell you. I think they'll do fine. You know, we had a huge crowd for our exhibition against Winthrop. We had almost 5,000 people at that game, and that was a big crowd. So they've seen a big crowd, and they've seen a big crowd here at our place, which is kind of cool. So I think they'll be okay, you know, but, uh, you know, that's the fun of it. You know, I had the opportunity many years ago to play in the ACC, and I can tell you that there are not rivalries in the ACC like Clemson and Carolina. So this is a game that our players are really lucky on a national level to be in a game like this. It's something they're going to talk about for all their years after they're done playing soccer. And for that, you know, it's a really great rivalry, a great game to be a part of. And, uh, you know, they'll look back on it with great memories, you know, 